let's have a brief discussion about taxes and in particular right now average tax rates and marginal tax rates so we don't confuse the terminology and we make ourselves clear when we're talking about tax burdens. The average tax rate is calculated by taking the number of dollars of taxes that you pay divided by the number of dollars of income that you earn. Real straightforward procedure. If you make uh, $50,000 and you pay $5,000 in taxes, then your average tax rate is 10%. Okay? Now, what we find is that with the American income tax system, as your income grows, your tax burden, in fact, your tax rate increases. We call that a progressive tax. If everybody always paid 10%, then we call that a proportional or flat tax. We'll get into some of those discussions in a minute. Let's look now at the marginal tax rate. Now, marginal, remember, in economics refers to change, extra. So what we're asking now is, what happens when you have a change in income? Let's look at some data. Suppose that when your income is $50,000, Your tax is $5,000, but if you were to get an, an increase in pay, let's say to $60,000, and we observe that your taxes went up to $7,500, well, what's happened to your tax burden? Well, first let's do the average tax rate, right? We did it the first time, $5,000 over $50,000 was 10%. But now you're going to pay $7,500 out of $60,000. And I guess I should have figured that out earlier, right? Uh, your tax rate's going to be in excess of 10%. Your tax rate went up when your income went up, a progressive tax. But let's don't look just at the average tax rate. Let's look at the marginal tax rate. In other words, what amount of tax are you paying on your extra income? And to do that, we take the change in the taxes that you pay divided by whatever your change in income was. So in this case, your taxes went up by $2,500. Your income went up by $10,000. And so your marginal tax rate in this example was 25%. In other words, of the extra $10,000 that you made, you pay 25% of that in taxes. Now, don't confuse the average tax rate and the marginal tax rate. They're not the same thing. The marginal tax rate talks about what are you paying on any additional income if you receive it. Now, let me illustrate very quickly how sometimes people don't keep this straight in their minds. I have had people on occasion tell me, I got a pay raise, but it pushed me up in such a higher bracket that I'm actually making less than I used to. And when they tell you that, you recognize right away they really don't understand what they're talking about, okay? How could you get a $10,000 pay raise, but after taxes be taking home less than you used to? Well, the only way for that to happen would be if your marginal tax rate was over 100%. In other words, they gave you a $10,000 pay raise and they raised your taxes by 11 or 12 or $13,000. It doesn't work that way. Marginal tax rates don't exceed 100%. And so the statement that, oh, I got pushed into a higher tax bracket and now I'm taking home less than I used to is nonsense. Okay, It's a little disconcerting when you try to explain that to somebody, so be careful. Okay? All right, average tax rate, marginal tax rate, keep them straight in your mind. We'll use them throughout the course. Thanks.